David, congratulations. Another victory and now 17 unbeaten in Skybet League 2. Yeah, you know, but the credit has got to go to uh, the football club, Mansfield Town, as, a, uh, as what we're trying to do moving forward. You know, we we had a stay over last night, a uh, place called the Forest Pines, and, and it gave us an opportunity to, to get some recovery into the players after a really tough performance against Swindon, you know, battling performance and... Uh, the club have backed me again, you know, and uh, getting these boys got all the control factors. It's really important, Steve, all that uh, you know, you're as professional as you can be. Certainly, you know, around Christmas time and New Year's Eve, and the, the players have committed to everything. But again, you know, the chairman, Carol, and Dave committed to, to to the plan and to what what we're trying to do. And um, just you know, to be away from your family's New Year's Eve is difficult, but everyone committed to it, and uh, you know, we've got we had a high powered. I thought it was a it was, first ten minutes we was wasn't quite quite at it, it was untidy, our work wasn't as careful as it has been. But once we'd sort of got used to our surroundings and, and used to, you know, uh, and worked them out, I th you know, how we not two, three, four goals to the good, I don't know. I really don't know that uh, the keeper was man of the match at our place and he was, again, man of the match today. Um, you know, but it's always, it's always tentative if you don't get that second one. I felt if we'd got that second one, and we had so many chances to get that second one. If you get that second one, you know, it's game over because I couldn't see them scoring. Um, but they might just nick one, you know, and even later on, they might just nick one. Uh, but Logs was a passenger second half. He had to do very little. I thought the three lads at the back was um, was absolutely outstanding. Uh, the, the energy that, that Aidan White and, and Mal Burning give us down the centre, of the, 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 down the width was was excellent. And, and, and again, Bish, I don't know how he keeps doing it. You know, that energy that he displays, that... That it's almost uh, it almost defies logic a little bit, you know, when you when you look at his legs and his power and his running power. Uh, I thought it was phenomenal. So, you know, it, it um, a brilliant squad performance. Everyone is committed to this to, to this win, and um, you know, I'm 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 really uh, delighted for the players and uh, and the supporters because to watch them celebrate with the with the supporters, you know, a local derby. Um, to watch them celebrate with the supporters, that means a lot to me that, you know, they've, they've travelled over again to come and support us in numbers. And when you see the players uh, being able to celebrate with the, with the supporters who pay a lot of money to watch football, um, it gives you a sense of pride. Because you're playing amidst this statistical unbeaten run, do you feel like you're getting momentum because of the run which you're on? A remarkable run. Um, I think... <laughs> When we talk about momentum, I think I think pre-season give us that, Steve. Well, I think when I look at a uh, building a foundation and building, you know, um, a platform of work and, and a, a real solid platform to work off, I think what we got, the work we got in for six weeks, that will give us the foundation and the platform to go on a run like we've gone on. Um, but you know, this is a difficult place. I think they've won the last five home games here. They've really turned the corner since since we beat them um, at the one call. You know, they've really turned the corner, and uh, they're young, they're energetic, they're doing exactly what the manager asks. They, they play with a no fear approach, and um, you know, they, they've got some dangerous players. So it's a really good win. I think the conditions sort of helped us a little bit. I've been I've been at Grimsby when on a Tuesday night when it's absolutely, you know flying in here you know the wind and, and that it's it's, it's like a, an hurricane at times but today it's been still it's been calm and um you know on the surface we, was okay um you know but at times we moved it really well and uh so professional but the, the, the word professional probably epitomizes what the performance has been in the last sort of 48 hours for for us as a group of players and staff uh the staff, you know, have committed incredibly to this uh, to this result. The backup staff, uh, whether that's massage, whether that's you know um, uh, DT doing his doing his work and, and doing you know the fitness work, they've all committed unbelievably to to the program and a, and a quite intense program. So delighted that we come out the other side um, now, and um, you know we can we can really plan and plot and navigate through January. <laughs> 